All right, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can move your YouTube channel from one email address to another. And as you can see, I have this channel over here with just one subscriber. So before you can move a YouTube channel to another email address, the first thing is to make sure that the channel is a brand channel, not just a normal channel. Now, this channel is not a brand channel, so I'm going to show you guys how to create a brand channel with your current channel first. And then I'm going to show you guys how to move the channel to another email address. I just want this to be the full video so that you don't have to confuse yourself or anything like that. Okay, so when you're on your channel, it should look like this. And then you can just click here and click YouTube Studio. So your studio page will open and then you need to just click on Settings. Alright, so I'm about to create the brand channel. But if your channel is already a brand channel, then you can skip this part. I'll put a timestamp to when you can start the transfer process. Okay, so for those of you who are not brand channels yet, click on channel, then click advanced settings, scroll down, and then click manage YouTube account. All right, so under the account section, click on add or manage your channels, and then click on create a channel. Now you can give it the same name as this channel, but I'll suggest not to because it may confuse you. So just give it any channel name you want. You can change it whenever you want. So I'll call this one test channel one. Click on I understand. My internet is a bit slow. So let's just wait for the button to come up. Okay, so click on create. And now we have created a brand channel. So we are going to move all the videos from the other channel onto this channel first before we transfer it to another account. So next you want to go back to the studio, YouTube studio. And then we're going to switch back to the channel we want to transfer. So this is the channel here, just select it. And now we have switched back to it. I'm sure you recognize the profile picture. So we click on settings, click channel, advanced, scroll down, manage YouTube account. I know all of this process looks a bit hectic, but after you do it the first time, you won't have to do it anymore. So next you click on advanced settings, and then you click on move channel to a brand account. So this page is going to show up. So just scroll down. And as you can see, we've already created a new brand account. And we want to move this channel into this brand account. So we click on replace. Okay, so whenever you're transferring your channel to a brand account, everything in that brand account will be deleted, including the likes, the subscribes, and everything. But since this is a new brand account, well, it doesn't have anything. So you should always create a new brand account before you do this. Don't do this on a channel that already has subscribers. Any established channels, don't do it on that. And then you click on I understand and click delete channel. Next, you're going to see this. So everything is going to be moved onto that um, channel. So click on move channel. So it says it has been done. So let's head back to studio. So when you go to studio.youtube.com, this is going to pop up because you don't have a channel anymore. Like your main account doesn't have a channel, it only has a brand channel and every YouTube account needs a main channel before it can have a brand channel. So just click on create channel. You're not going to be using the channel that it creates anyway, so just don't worry about it. Now as you can see, a new main channel has been created, but um, if you click here and you click switch account, you're going to see that the email address you use now has two channels. So this is the brand channel and this is the main channel. So click on the brand channel to switch to it. As you can see, we still have our one subscriber here. If there were videos, the videos will still be here. And now we can start moving the channel to another email address. So for those of you who already have brand accounts, this is the point you can start watching from. All right, so you click on settings and then you click on permissions. Now, this is the reason why we need a brand account because without a brand account, you're not going to see this option. So yeah, click on this and then click on manage permissions. So this is going to show up and now you click on this to add a new email address, the email address you want to transfer the channel to. So for this, I'll be using this email. So you can see my picture over here just to be sure. And when it says choose a role, then you choose owner. Now make sure whenever you're doing this, you are not using the email address of anyone because so many people have gotten hacked by this. So try to make sure that whenever someone asks you to add them to your YouTube channel, you are not adding them as an owner or a manager. So make sure you don't do that. You can always use editor. I don't know the others, but editor is the best. You would find those options here because this is like the top roles that you can give anybody to take over your channel. 
all right so enough talking just click on owner and then you click invite so it's going to send an email to this email address and now i'm going to switch to gmail all right so i've received the email it's going to be in your primary tab but i just moved it to the promotions tab because i have so many other emails that i want to keep private anyways you're going to receive an email and then you open it and you're going to see that someone is inviting you to share ownership of the name of the channel then you click on accept invitation and like i said just this should be your own email address not someone else's email and then you click accept so yeah that one is done we will head back to the studio dashboard and close this i'm going to refresh this page now if i click here and i click switch account you'll see that this email also has access to this channel so two emails now have access to this channel and um, i can manage all the videos and whatever it is from this channel so the way youtube works is you know some people may get hacked through this feature so whenever you open your dashboard and you click on your profile picture you see that um, someone else has access to your email you have a week to remove them but because this is a tutorial well i'm going to leave it so that after a week i'll be able to delete the channel from this email address and fully transfer it to this email address so today is the 6th of july and it's a wednesday so by next week i'll be able to transfer the channel fully to this email address and i'll be showing you guys that as well so this video is going to have to pause now and um, by next week i'll show you the rest of the process all right so you guys remember we are trying to move this channel from this email address onto this new email address and uh, yeah today is the seventh day so it's the 13th of um, july hopefully it will work i'm not really sure because i'm thinking it should work tomorrow but i'm just going to try it out and see so as usual you log into the account where the channel was originally made so this account in my case you guys should know the email address you created the channel initially so you click on settings or you tap on it if you're using a phone and then you click permissions and click manage permissions so this page is going to open i'm sure you guys are familiar with it but it's been almost one week so i don't really remember all the things that are here so i'll click on manage permissions now and then i think it's going to ask me to sign in yeah so i'm going to impute my password now and then i'll click next all right so next i'm going to click manage permissions and then hopefully now i'll be able to switch from this email onto this email so next you want to change this account to primary owner and then you click transfer and now it says transferring ownership so as you can see this new email or account is now the primary owner of the channel and this guy is just an owner but not necessarily like this email doesn't have full control over the channel and now you see this x button here if you click on it it's going to remove this email address that is the original slash initial email address as the owner of the channel so click remove and yeah this channel no longer has or this email no longer has um, access to the channel so i'm going to show you guys that it's real if i close this if i click on account it's not even working right now because the page needs to refresh so i'm going to refresh this as you can see it says something went wrong so i'm going to delete this if this happens to your browser just go to settings where is settings i swear sometimes these things are hard to find and then you go to privacy and security come to site and shield settings and then click on this search for youtube i can see youtube right here but search for it just in case you don't find it click this and click clear data because of this error so if i refresh now this error should go away as you can see now i can access the channel so now if i click on this you see that uh, this email doesn't have any channel under it and um, the channel has been moved onto this email address so this guy is now the full owner of this channel so that is how you transfer your channel from one email address to another 
And uh, as I said, try to be careful. Don't allow anyone to become a manager or an owner of your channel. Some people do that to hack others and yeah, just be sure that you are aware of this. Anyways, you are aware of this now. So if you guys have questions, please leave them in the comments. And yeah, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.